Okay, hello folks. Welcome back to Caves of Cud. Yes, level 23. Um, yeah, this run has been pretty good, right? Like I, at the la at uh, in the last stream, I'm going to do kind of recaps now. I think that would be useful whenever I start a new stream. Um, we did Golgotha essentially and went through no problem at all, actually. Like, this was really good. Um, I found a bunch of cool stuff, floating glow spheres. We have a folded carbide wrist blade, so we can use the two-handed Rhinox skull maul with an offhand short blade, which is great. We have fuller right boots, carbide plate armor, you know, we're, we're kind of getting there. Thing is, um, I cannot use the, the gesticulating gauntlets anymore because I need to use a floating glow sphere because the night vision bugged out and we with this character we cannot use night vision anymore so that's just a thing but since I found a floating glow sphere we are fine so right now for this stream for the next few videos my plan is to slowly go north towards Bethesda Sousa we're gonna go north I might do a little detour over to the spire and the asphalt mines. I'm not sure. Maybe I will do it, maybe I won't. We could also just do Bethesda Sousa. Um, Bethesda Sousa is kind of scary though, so uh, we're gonna see. Right now we're still in the ruins and uh, we might do a little cursory ruin exploration. Um, yeah, again, we are, yeah, this character is as adept in cudgels as in axes, so we might actually also, we have a fuller right set of axe and short blade, which is also nice, but I think I'm going to stick with them all for the time being, but I'm just going to carry that stuff around, so, on that mercurial went haywire that is weird that looked like the the seeker sundered their own mind which is honestly impressive a thermoelectric cell and another laser rifle and now we're carrying too much obviously okay um let me see. There's another thermoelectric cell. They only weigh one pound, so they are kind of neat. A laser rifle, we don't need that. We have too much crap here, don't we? Okay, I don't need the Borderlands revolvers. Um, this is jewel encrusted and... Why does this no weigh? Oh, because it's willowy. It does not weigh anything. That's fun. Take the cell out and disassemble. We don't need that gas pump. Yeah, definitely a power move. We're gonna keep the freeze ray and probably also the carbine. That stuff is pretty heavy though. So I'm not sure. Um. Yeah, 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 we have cl cloning draft, draught, 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 I always confuse those two. Convalescence, yeah, we have some, we have some cool stuff, ah, but it's way too heavy. Is there anything I can, oh, we have the full, uh, the fuller right set here, we might deposit that somewhere. Um, oh yeah, the 12 solar seeds, I don't need those anymore. Because Golgotha was no problem. Uh, which would bark? Some raw bore meat, we can do that. Yeah, I have too many cells. I have way too many cells. So first of all, let's disassemble every, th every cell that is not full. Because we have too much. Two drained cells even. 
uh, combustion cell. I'm going to keep the high capacity and the fidget cells. Uh, I think I'm going to get rid of the combustion cell. Oh yeah. Oiled myself up with that. And you know what? We have so many basic chem cells that I'm just going to disassemble these. Slender kilt jaw. Yeah, we got rid of a bunch of nonsense here. Ape fur gloves. Give us cold resist. Might be useful for Bethesda, actually. Compass bracelet. Engraved compass ba bracelet. Snakeskin armlet. We only need one compass bracelet. Let's get rid of that. Metamorphic polygel. We have eight HE missiles for some reason. I hate that you pick those up automatically. Okay. Yeah, well, this stuff is too heavy. And obviously what is really heavy is our armor stuff. Yeah, like, even, like we have 35 pound heavy boots, which is kind of ridiculous actually. Like, we're, we're kind of stomping around. Which is kind of fun, actually. But, yeah. Okay, a few turrets. They don't really... No, we still get experience from those. Okay, there's a drill bot down there. Not scared of drill bots. Disassemble this stuff immediately. Alright. Let's do auto exploration. Alright, let's go down. Dragonfly? Are you okay? For some reason, the dragonfly was hostile. Don't know why. Okay, so uh, yeah, we're just going to do a bit of ruin exploration now. Again, just cursory. We're not going to go in too deep. I think they're teleporting. Oh, implanted eater. Okay. We have another one of these. What do we have here? Weird artifact. Skill soft demolish. This is actually kind of neat. Um, because demolish, isn't that, isn't that the best cudgel thing? Yeah, it is. And it's 300. So... It's three points, but we also can upgrade our license a bunch. Yeah, only by two. So we would need to uninstall something. Translucent skin. Nah, I kind of want all of that. I mean, I cannot get rid of the night vision. That isn't working anymore. So, still not a fan of that. But, well, that's our lot in life now. Huh. The hermit had two bucklers, two iron bucklers, but no weapon. Oh, there's another one. Cool. Weird artifact. Transparent skin. Plus three dodge value. So... That's a better form of translucent skin, I think. Uh, skills. Character. Where was it? Inventory? No. Equipment. Yeah, equipment. Cybernetic. Translucent skin. Plus two dodge value. And this is plus three dodge value, isn't it? But 
Hmm. It's also a three one. However, I could have just gone to the one on top, whatever. Let's uninstall the translucent skin. Complete. Install cybernetics. Transparent skin into our body. Complete. Okay. I think that should work. Now we have one additional dot value. You know? Again, we're kind of going for armor here, as you can see. But it's better to have it than to not have it. Okay, let's get rid of the mercurial here. We're just going to take out the the crabs one by one. I'm pretty easy at this point. Let's murder the slumbling. Three hit. Okay. Fine. I'll take a three hit slumbling kill. Okay. All right, that's good. Can we go down? Can't safely reach the stairs, but where are the stairs? Probably behind some acid. Ah, over there, okay. So let's cross the acid. Yes, and go down. All right. Okay, we have a laser turret up there. That's a chain gun turret. As long as it's not a rocket turret, we're good. Okay, what do we have? Chem cell. Just one chem cell. And a high capacity fidget cell. Good. Okay. We kind of have too many cells. But then again... Why not? Oops, got teleported away. We're also hungry, so let's get rid of the beetles. Get rid of the beetles! Never liked the mu music anyways. No, whatever. I'm indifferent towards the beetles. Um, cook, preserve fresh food, yes. And what do we have? We can <laughs> we can cook with lava if we want it. Let's put in some convalescence. How about that? Let's do convalescence, board jerky because we have a lot of it, and some vine wafer. Okay, you eat the meal. So cold resist whenever you take damage, you don't thirst. Max HP, you thirst at half rate, can use freezing hands. That's good. This is can use cryokinesis. Probably be even better. Whenever you drink fresh water, there's a 25%. I think I'm going to take this one. Thirst at half rate, can use freezing hands, and uh, yeah, we're going to have a recipe for that. One thing that I need to do, I need to clean up my recipes a bit because there's a bunch of crap in there that we don't really need to keep saved. All right. Giant beetle. More giant beetles. There's so many of them. Doesn't seem to be a nest around there. I know that they can have a nest, but, um, yeah. Widgets. There's rifle turrets behind this. Could also be musket turrets. Can we bash through this? Uh, it will take a while. Still not strong enough to... Slam it. Oh, lightly damaged. Yeah. Full creed as always. Yeah, they're just inside the walls. Huh. Okay. 
I mean, fine. Okay, we're just going to go down a little bit further. Okay, there's another laser turret. The, the electromagnetic sensor is really good, actually. Like for this kind of stuff. There's some amount of, you know, like if, if there would be a rocket turret, I would want to know. I would want to know a rocket turret before I can see it. And uh, there was at least one instance where that already became a thing. Uh-huh. Okay, there's some stuff here. Chem cell. We don't actually need another chem cell, but whatever. Okay. Yeah, once you're once you're strong enough, going into these can actually be kind of lucrative. Oh, another floating glow sphere and a chain pistol. Um, I think at some point we might actually already be there, but at some point you outpace the loot that you can get here. So, but uh, for now, it's fine. We can still find stuff that and that's interesting. We get a few things. Okay, is that a voider boss thingy? It's just a normal voider. Phase web. Uh huh. Doesn't seem to be a boss group. It's just a bunch of. Oh no, now I'm phased. <laughs> okay. But I'm unfazed from being phased. If you know what I mean. Okay. It's actually kind of useful. All right. Fire and yeah, that's that's everything. What are we level five? I'm not going to go much further than level five. Okay, that's just a drill bot. Just sh laser shoot the. The acid slug. And that's it again. Hmm. We will go a bit further. This is an uninteresting one. Okay, there's a saw hander. And a few corpses. And some stuff down there. Maybe this is more interesting than I thought. Saw handles aren't really a problem anymore, which is good. And these are just bones, okay. What a pity. But it's okay. Alright. Anything here? Fresh water, fresh water. Downstairs. Collect a bit of fresh water, why not? Give me ten of these drums. Alright. And we can go down here. Um, should we do one more? Let's do one more map. bound to come across some oh yeah here we are these are the shitty snail things yeah i don't want to deal with those so you know what let's go up that's it for this at some point you always come across these things down here and uh right now if i don't have to i kind of don't want to deal with it all right okay another thing that we sh could do actually now that i think about it we could go beneath grid gate right i mean 
Sure, how about we do that? How we go how about we go beneath grid gate? I haven't done that a lot of times. I think that was actually also re refashioned, wasn't it? Let me see. First of all, cook from a recipe. Oh, let's just do this one. 15% max HP. That's nice. Okay. Um, is there stairs down? Yes, here. Oh, cellar door is locked. Okay, I think we need to do Bethesda Sousa first before we can go beneath grid gate. I kind of forgot about how this all works. Just remember that at some point you can get down there. Okay. been here before We've been here before and now we're in the jungle again good Okay, something happened here. Okay, these are Naftali corpses. Somebody murdered a lot of Naftalis here. Which... Certainly interesting. Canteen with fresh water. Did I pick it up? Yeah. Do we need that? Kinda don't, but whatever. Still getting up there in terms of... Did I kill those Naftalis? Might be, I think I've passed through here before. Yeah, I must have. I've explored these before. Maybe it was me. <laughs> oh my god, who did this atrocity? Why did I unequip the Ulnar Stimulators? That's weird. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know why I did that. Jungle is not terribly exciting, is it? Oh yeah, right. I probably came this way when I... Uh, well, not this way specifically, but I went north when I went to... To Golgotha, obviously. going to disassemble all these desert rifles I mean we will get the um, the a thingy the tinkering bit that we need to use for recharging cells so that's kind of nice because I definitely don't need that many cells to carry around okay there is a that's shade oil Oh, we didn't have shade oil yet. Shade oil is really useful. It's good to get out of a sticky situation. Okay. A few 
the goat folk. Murdering goat folk is still useful, even at this stage, so... You know, it's one of the few things that still gives you a decent amount of XP, so... Even if it is already halved, but... Yeah. Well, let's just keep going. We're gonna have kind of a long trek through the jungle. Maybe if we're lucky, we're gonna find like a boss group or two. I don't know. Otherwise, this is not really the most exciting thing. Uh, fungus patch. You know what? Let's go around that fungus patch. Not really interested in dealing with the fungus infection right now, especially because uh, the the corpse requirement to get rid of it is I don't know is an enemy that I don't know if I've ever seen. So probably have at some point, but what do we have here? Lustine gloves? No. Lacquered jewel encrusted desert rifle. Probably worth a bunch. Still gonna disassemble it. Because it's not like. You know, water is kind of no problem right now. We can just afford kind of anything at this point. If we need. Where are we? Okay. We are in a, in a small flower field. How nice. Look at those pretty, pretty flowers. Everywhere. Okay, just that. Chromling. Don't need the stun rod. to disassemble the cell and then disassemble the stun rod yes okay still have not got harvestry yeah I should definitely get that I might just Puma Shitin vest. It's kind of neat. Don't really. That's a rare butchery item. But you know, nope. Sturdy magnetized boots. Hmm. Can disassemble those? Yes. We're just collecting bits at this point. Fortunately, Argive did not have any interesting data disks. I also, I think I forgot, yeah, I did not talk, I did not try to trade with Q-Girl. I think Q-Girl would have been able to sell us some interesting data disks as well. I think she does. Oh, let's just auto-explore this little patch of jungle, because uh, there's scrap around and... With auto exploration, we will automatically disassemble it. Also, you don't need to press anything, which is very nice. Oops. Oh, there's a Barathromite boss group. Hello, folks. Maybe I can get something from them. Hello. Um. Who are you? Loved by the Barathromites, disliked by fish for releasing snakes into one of their camps. Yeah, that's not a nice thing to do. I might do the water ritual, actually. Because whatever. What about fish, you know? Um, to 
craft a flamethrower. That, that's neat. I mean, why not? I can I can get that. Let's share some secrets. Okay. Poison gas grenade. Not really. Water sister. Buffepia. <laughs> yeah, I would like to know how to craft a flamethrower. You know, you never know when that would be useful. So, do your trade. Yes. Gesticulating. That's actually kind of cool. Data disk for a geomagnetic disk, but that's Tinker too, yeah. Uh, Willowy is also kind of nice. That means, yeah, I might get these two. Sniper rifle is neat, but probably I don't need to craft it. Okay, let's get rid of some crap. Let's go down here. Okay, the bronze ingots are too heavy. I think I'm going to get rid of one of them. Um, and one book, maybe? Yeah, like this. Yeah, sure. Trade complete. Neat. Okay, so, data disks. Where are the data disks? Here we go. So gesticulating, willowy. Gesticulating is, ah, uh, well, ugh, right. We cannot really use gesticulating because we need the floating thing. Always forget about that. Plus bionic hands, plus one agility. Yeah, no. Translucent skin. I'm going to drop this one. Or at least I'm going to sell this one. Wait. Anybody has something else? No. Do you have something? Nope. Nope. Okay. How much do we get from... Yeah, it's too much, actually. Ah, uh, well. Let's keep it for now. But we're gonna get rid of those. Soon-ish. Way too many Naftali in this map not interested in dealing with all of that and a bunch of goat folk here more interested in dealing with that to be quite honest stop blowing me up thank you ah boss group okay i think we're going to try and murder this boss group i think we're going to be fine let's just soften them up a bit That's the sewers. Need to be careful about those. Okay, that's one sewer. Let's see. Who likes you, who doesn't like you? Hated by flowers. Okay, that's fine. And the floating glows and a weird artifact. Okay, I wonder what that is. Might have been that grenade. <laughs> okay. Murder the ranged folks. Okay. I'm just going to disassemble the cell because it was just a chem cell, I think. Was it? I hope so. Put in another chem cell. Ah, there's the, the horn blower. Okay, that guy wants to go melee. 
gladly do that. Okay, Hornblower is dead. This guy's badly wounded and bleeding. Okay. Yeah, we're kind of at the point. Steel shield, neat. Uh, we're kind of at the point where goat folk boss groups are pretty easy to deal with. That's good. Over to the east, okay. Hello. It's always nice when the things that are super scary at first become like eh. What's this? It's a full chem cell. Sure, pick it up. Alright. Okay, cool. Yeah, the laser rifles are actually not bad. I'm a... Uh, it's a good... workable... ranged weapon. Oops, famished. Okay. Cook... preserve... cook from a recipe... let's just... let's just do HP for now. Oh! There is a lair here of a legendary hide sheathed hermit there's oops there's some confusing stuff I'm still confused okay seems to be seekers disciple of the sightless way yeah Who are you? Snapjaw Trapper. Puma Shitin Vest. Okay, I mean, we've, we've done that before. Like we've butchered one of these before. But cast net. They can trap you in a net. That's cool. Should we explore that lair? I think we should explore that lair. Who are you? Mechanimus Zealot. I still get 80 XP from that. <laughs> As a shrine. Okay, that's a shrine with a bedroll on top of it. Somebody was having a good night's sleep, apparently. Cyberneticist. Okay. Not hostile, can murder. Not hostile, can murder is a. Oh yeah, confused again. The Wahumum dies. That was the seeker thing. Ah, confusion is such a fun effect in this. Killed, okay. Stop being confused, please. Okay. That's an Aquanaut, is it? Yeah, you have a weird artifact. Do we pick it up? Do we pick it up? Yes, we did. Stun gas grenade, MK1, yeah. Not interested. Are you a nice frog? Yeah. The bloody ice frog dies. Well, let's just go down. Kind of collecting a bunch of nonsense here. Fourteen bones. 
Okay. I think this rather means 14 sets of bones. Not 14 bones in total. But you know. Okay. <laughs> There's a room full of seed spitting vines. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Snap your feeders. Interesting. Plastic tree. We can disassemble the plastic tree. However that works. Okay. There's more high level snap jaw things. The trappers again. We actually got trapped by the trapper. More bones. And an egg or maggot. Let's let the whatever gas over there dissipate. Lots of bones. And just storing bones down here. Snap your feeders. Yeah, 11H, uh, 11 XP is not that. Okay, I think there was a chest there or something, but it got disintegrated by the stuff. Okay. This might not be useful. This layer. Yeshua skin slippers. What does that do? Plus 20 move speed. That's actually kind of neat. Um, how heavy is it? Whatever. We're just going to pick it up. Another weird artifact. Acid gas grenade. Disassemble. Symbol. Hey, 25 grams of wine. Do we have any wine? Let's see. To another container. We don't have wine. Let's collect 15 grams of wine. I think that's enough. For one evening, that is. Okay. Not just spear fiend <laughs> with poison tipped spears. Nasty. For some reason the beetle bums are hostile. Okay. Nothing too interesting so far. Another grenade. I need to take apart a bunch of the grenades that I'm carrying around. Oh, there's a boss. That is the legendary hide sheathed hermit. Um, you know, we're just going to murder everything else. Right now. And uh, then we're probably going to kill the boss, even though the boss themselves are not hostile. Tyler. It's Tyler. Hi, Tyler. Disliked by insects and the children of Mammon. Hated and loved by hermits. I'm probably going to get in trouble with hermits for that, but uh, you know what? I'm going to risk that. Why not? to murder the hermits anyways even if they're not hostile um okay where are you there you are doesn't really have anything interesting but uh punch 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 remains stunned badly wounded and murdered good okay yeah that's it nothing nothing Well, that was a nice little diversion. Okay. Well, then let's keep going north. Well, we actually... Let's 
still hostiles nearby. Okay. You know what? We're just going to make our way towards Bethesda right now. Even if we don't do it immediately, or if we just dip our toes in it, uh, let's just pay it a little visit. How about that? We're pretty, pretty well on our way to the next level, which is level 24, which will give us another, another point. It's good. This late in the game, every level up is uh, kind of a momentous occasion. Okay. Who's shooting? You are shooting. Okay. Disassemble. Move. There's a good amount of goats around here. Good for the experience bar. Yeah, the, the hermits are hostile now. I mean, that's okay. Could be worse. Fast forward a bit, and we're getting killed by some power hermit. Okay. Goats. Shaman, normal goats. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Give me all the goats. I require goat sacrifice. Headlamp. That's kind of neat. I'm going to pick up the headlamp just in case. And we're level 24. Nice. Good. Um, all right. So we have... Okay. You know what? We're going to get Demolish. I'm not going to do it via Skillsoft. So we're going to get that. And Harvest Tree. Oh, we don't have enough for Harvest Tree. Okay. So Demolish, Demolish, Demolish. Stands is B. Okay, need to need to remember that. Okay, good. We're getting closer to Bethesda. Need to make our way north again. It's been a long time since I had a character on at 24. This has been quite the interesting run. Also, let me see, equipment. Yeah, we have the penetration of the Rhinox Skull Mall on maximum right now. So we definitely need to find some good data disks for that. You know, I would want to do some, for example, counterweighted. Something that increases damage. On these items. Oh, I'm famished. Oh, no. Let's cook. Let's just do this for now. Once we get to Bethesda, we need to do some proper cooking again for some actual good stuff. We don't really need freezing hands though, but uh, yeah. 
freezing hands is probably not useful for Bethesda Sousa. But yeah. That's the hills. Okay. Probably nothing here. More hills. Let's, yeah, let's stay in the jungle. Blowing everything up, my friend. Everything. Yeah, like just running through the jungle. It's never the most eventful stuff. But you know. Oh, that was a boss. Whoops! Ahum. That definitely hurt my reputation with robots. My copper nugget is destroyed? What the hell? Okay. Picked it up and it immediately disintegrated itself. Sure. Sawar. Okay, that is just some ruins. Sure, why not? Let's explore them. Goats in the ruins. That's the name of my science fiction book. It's weird science fiction. This is kind of an int intricate ruin tile. Jeez. Okay. Thank whomever for auto exploration. Otherwise, this would kind of take forever. Okay. Being in motion, shaded by the end. This sounds like some some good books. New power you must. This is a Yoda fanfiction. West, I slept. That's a good book. Uh, that's actually a great title. Probably a uh, collection of poems. Sometimes the auto-exploration is weirdly inefficient. Right, we just went past this thing. Hey, a metal folding chair. Also, I'm carrying way too much again. So, did I pick up some crappy armor? Headlamp is six, oh dear. Okay, we don't need all these compass bracelets. We are never going to use this. Okay. Artifacts. Grenade. Phase conjugate thermal grenade. What does that mean? Shifts phase immediately before detonating. <laughs> That's cool. Well, MK1. Probably don't need it. Another weird artifact. That's a freezing carbide short sword. Nah. Drop it. Okay, um, I still have 20. Disassemble a few more cells. Do it with food. Now we can probably cook some food. And I have, okay. You know what, we're going to disassemble all the MK1 grenades that we have, at least. It goes. And how about that one as well? Electrified steel longsword. Why am I carrying that crap around? Okay, uh, we're going to disassemble the cell that is in it and drop it. Yeah, because it's an artifact, obviously. Yeah, sure. Okay. 
I still have the dormant way droid. Don't need that. Okay, you know what? We need to drop the ones that we don't need. Okay. High grade dermal insulation. I'm going to keep that one. That is fine. That is fine. I'm going to disassemble the droid scrambler. At some point we should use the two war recoil. I don't know where two war is, but yeah. Metal folding chair. And yeah, we have a lot of We are carrying a lot of liquids. Okay. Just a little bit of inventory cleaning. And we can we can carry four hundred and fifty pounds of crap. So kinda good on that on that end. Fermented yuckweed stem. I'm definitely going to take that. This and this. I'm going to disassemble the semi automatic pistol and continue. Okay. Mm hmm. Goat folk savage. Anything? No. Nope. Well, that's it for those ruins. That was kind of just a bit of tedium there without really finding anything. More jungle. Let's go north. Outskirts Bethesda Sousa. Here we are. Um, you are Craig Mensch Boulderer, right? Can we? Ah, oh, yeah, we we are pretty good at murdering them. That is good. All right. Yeah, we we have some really good penetration here. They drop way faster than I thought. Hey, and that one dropped a Taco Th Suprema. Nice. Okay, I'm just going to end the recording, and uh, we're gonna be back in a second. I'm going to take a quick break as well. I need to get some more water. See you in a moment. <laughs> 